windowcleaner.com. What's up guys, Matt here, service industry coach. Hey, I wanna to talk to you guys today about every door direct mail versus door hangers and what's better. We get it all the time. Like what would you do if you're just starting out would you rather do Everdoor direct mail or door hangers? And it's really not even a fair question. So I'm gonna go through the two with you right now, uh, kind of both pros and cons of both, and then you can decide for yourself what's a better fit for you. So early on in my cleaning business, we could not afford Everdoor direct mail. It's roughly 17 cents per piece, plus you gotta pay to have it designed, printed, right? And so we couldn't afford that, you know, first, second year in business. So we went the door hanger route, and we actually even did little postcards, uh, same thing. They convert the exact same. And so what we would do is we would hit the same neighborhoods every single month. Every 30 days, I would go and postcard or put door hangers up on the same houses in the same neighborhood. Now, the most important part of this whole thing is that you have to do it every 30 days, okay? We found that our conversions became a lot higher, and after doing this for about a year, we started to dominate these neighborhoods. And as our business naturally grew, we started to get a bigger budget for marketing, and then we transferred over to every door direct mail. You see, the only downside to doing door hangers versus mailing out your advertisement is that you can only get so many of them out, right? It's not that scalable unless you're gonna pay employees to go out and put a bunch out for you, which when you do the math, it's actually cheaper to mail them. And so as our marketing budget grew, we went to every door direct mail, and then we went from putting out a couple thousand door hangers or postcards a month to doing 10 to 20,000 postcards per month. And so naturally we had the exact same approach. The only benefit to every door direct mail was we could get a lot more out and we could get into neighborhoods that we weren't able to get into uh, doing them by hand. And so really, there's only a couple different differences. One, with door hangers, you're only gonna be able to get into certain neighborhoods, right? But it's a lot more cost effective but you won't be able to get as many out. With every door direct mail, you can get a ton out, you can get into any neighborhood you want to, but it's gonna cost you more to play that game, but both of them work great. So if you're early on in your business, I would suggest get out there, go hustle, put as many of those things on doors as you can, hit the same neighborhoods every 30 days, and be committed to doing that. And I promise, if you keep doing it over and over, it'll pay off, and if you have a little bit more of an established company, you know, put up the cash, go mail every door direct mail, in the same approach, every 30 days, the same neighborhoods, change up your specials a little bit, and it just works. It's how I built literally my entire cleaning business and got it to where it is today. windowcleaner.com